Hey everyone, Nilabo here, and today what I'm going to be doing is I'm going to be showing you the Driving Force GT um, made for Gran Turismo 5 and for the PC. So let's just get into it. Oh, over here we have this, the wheel. You can do one whole 360 and then a little. Uh, okay, both sides. As you can see. And this basically counts as your PlayStation remote, because as you can um, for um, for Gran Turismo 5, because as you can see, you have the L3 and the R3. You have your analog stick, basically uh, the start and select button, the the PS button, um, L2 and R2, and you have obviously the basic buttons. Then, obviously, it's not just going to be the <clears throat> the wheel and the pedals, we're going to have the gear. Now the gear is basically, it's not like a car, you have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, and 6 and 7 sometimes. The gear is plus and minus. Okay, so if it's on 1, if you do a plus, it's going to come to 2, obviously. Uh, okay. And the same thing now. What I'm going to be showing you now is these. The pedals are actually really, really cool pedals. It's like you're driving. So this is the, ex the, the acceleration one. And this is the brake. The brake becomes a bit harder. And the acceleration is very easy to push down. Um. And obviously, this is made by Logi. Lo, uh, let me see, Logitech or Logitech. I don't know how to say it. Uh, it's not plugged in right now, so that's not lighting. But every time you want to start, you plug it into the PlayStation. Obviously, then from a wall plug, you have to plug into this with this wire, and does um, Dragon Force GT on it. So thank you guys for watching, um, please remember to subscribe, comment, favorite, like and all that. Thanks so much for watching.